Hi, my name is Eric Ring, and I'm an associate and a mechanical engineer here at LPA. And today we're going to talk a little bit about integrated design. What really sets LPA apart is that we are truly a multidisciplinary firm, and that we don't isolate the disciplines from one another. We don't have an architectural division and a landscape architecture division and a structural engineering division, but we have teams where architects, landscape architects, interior designers, and engineers are really working together and truly collaborating as part of one team and not part of separate groups within the same company. For example, in our K-12 market segment, we're currently designing a project for Sweetwater Unified School District, which is uh, the Montgomery Middle School. It's an expansion to that campus. The client has asked us to make it lead platinum and, um, and to have a significant rooftop uh, solar photovoltaic array. Um, that had real implications though for how we planned the space architecturally and uh, mechanically because generally those mechanical systems would occupy that rooftop space. But because of the integrated nature of our process, um, I was able to sit down with the principal designer Wendy Rogers early on and we were able to brainstorm solutions to this. Um, and really Wendy as the architect came up with mechanical solutions that we ultimately integrated into the project. And we've got a really successful design um, that's currently in construction documents right now, uh, really that ties back to that careful integration between our disciplines and with our client and their goals. Another example would be the Newport Beach Learning Center, which is a project that we're currently designing for the Coastline Community College District. This client is looking for an architecturally distinctive building, and, and the site has sort of dramatic, fantastic uh, ocean views that we really want to celebrate. Um, but it, it's also, those views happen to be facing uh, the ocean, which in Newport Beach is to the southwest, which is one of the more problematic uh, solar exposures uh, for us to try to um, control the solar loads and air condition that sort of space. It has relatively small classrooms with relatively high occupants, and trying to maximize and optimize all of those aspects of the project has led us to really unique structural solutions as far as a low height building using a concrete structure, to unique mechanical solutions where we're using 100% outside air because frankly the ventilation load is the cooling load in, in, a, in a dense classroom in Newport Beach. Um, and to really spectacular architectural solutions as well. And none of those things would be possible if, it, if we didn't have uh, structural engineers, mechanical engineers, and the architect all really closely collaborating their designs and closely collaborating those and integrating those with the client and their goals as well. A lot of issues in sustainability are about integration and synergies. Designing a, a better envelope, for example, the glass and the walls and the roofs that make up the building has a dramatic impact on the HVAC systems and the lighting systems in the building. So if we can work together between mechanical engineers, architectural designers, structural engineers, electrical engineers to really optimize all of those systems together, to deliver buildings that are, that are beautiful and that are functional and that are also energy efficient, then we can really have more successful designs. Again, my name is Eric Ring. Thanks for watching this video about integrated design at LPA and please do check out our website.